to mean? I think it means that it was unfair somehow. Okay, I'm not dumb. Whoa, who do you guys think that it's about? You! It was definitely you! How do you know? There's like five giant men coming towards us, so... I need you two guys and the girl with pink hair to come with me right now. Whoa. I did not do anything wrong. You participated in the voting. It was for him to stay. All three of you will be executed. You can't execute me if I run. You know, you ah. kind of look like an ostrich when you run. Who are you and why did you follow me? I just ran because you were running too. I don't even know who you are. Anyway, um, could you vote for me to stay, please? Sure, but only if you vote for me to stay, too. I will. Deal. Deal. Hey, guys, there she is. Um, I have to go. Before you go, my name's Luke. Okay, I didn't ask. I'm gonna have an asthma attack. What? Are you seriously yeah. wearing one of my shirts again? Yes. I told you to stop going in my closet. Please, just this one time. Fine, only because I feel bad for you. Aw, oh, look, it's little Miss Goody Two Shoes. I'll take that. Give it back. Or what? What are you gonna do? Or I'm gonna... Exactly what I thought. You can't even lie. Whatever, I'll just get a new pen. Everyone, please welcome our new student, Matt. Ooh, he's kinda cute. I mean, if you're into that. Hey, yeah, I thought he was cute. What? You know I can't lie? Are you the girl who always tells the truth? How do you know that? You literally just said you can't lie. Right. Why can't you lie? That's so weird. I don't know. I just can't. I want you to work with me here. When I lie, nothing shows up on my arms. What? I have an offer that you can't pass up. What kind of offer? Let's work together. We can be a great team. Work together to do what? I just met you. I want to stop lying to people. I'm stuck in a hole. What's in it for me? I will teach you how to lie. Maybe I don't want to lie. Oh, come on. Lying comes in handy sometimes. No. Sorry. Good morning. It would be a better morning if you weren't here. Dang, that's a little harsh. Sorry. Can't lie. We could just pretend to date instead. It would have the same effect. Ew. Come on, just think about it. There's nothing to think about. I already told you, no. Well, there's one thing that you're forgetting. And what would that be? I'll tell everyone who you really are. So, do you want them all to find out, or are you going to work with me? Fine. Hey, what's above my head? It's clearly a button. What do you mean? I can see that. Oh, well, you're not allowed to press it. Why not? Because nobody knows what it's gonna do. Well, then why is it even there? It's for decoration. Don't press it. You saying don't press it makes me want to press it more. Hey, did any of you guys press your button? No way. We can't do that. Why? It could be dangerous. What if it ends the human race? Would that be so bad? Bitch, yeah, that would be really, really bad. Whatever. I won't press it. Okay, good. Don't be an idiot. I need to go to the bathroom. I have to know what it does. It can't be, like, that bad, right? I mean, I'm not afraid of death. Mmm... Whatever. Oh. Oh, no! Excited for your first day of the new school? No, not at all. Well, that's not a very good attitude. You know I'm not ready to go back to school after what happened. I understand, but you have to go. It's not up to me. Class, class, please settle down. Everyone welcome our new student, Bailey. Hi. Boo! Go home! You can have a seat next to Ryan in the back. Hey, what's up? I'm Ryan. I'm Bailey. So, why is your heart meter so low? Is that seriously the first thing you're gonna ask me? Yeah, but I was just curious. I want to be friends. Well, I'm not looking for friends, so... Hey, look who it is. My best friend's back. You're not going to give up, are you? No, I have never given up on anything. It's not like anyone else is going to want to be your friend. Excuse me? Shit, I need a charge before I have to go to school. Honey, you're going to be late. I know, Mom. I just need a charge for one second. You don't have any time. We need to go now. Okay, I'll charge at school. You already plugged yourself in this early in the day? Uh, yeah, I think my night cord like doesn't work or something. Be careful not to run out of battery. I'm not going to.
Can you guys watch us while I go to the bathroom? Yeah, of course we can. Thanks. Thanks, guys. I'm back. Where did they go? Ms. Michaels, where did my friends go? I'm not sure. They ran out with that cord you left. I can't run after them. I'm going to run out of battery life. Hey, do you know what happens when someone runs out of battery? Um, yeah, you die. Duh. What? I need to go. Guys, come back here. You're going to have to come get it back from us if you want it. Wait, what is that? Looks 10, intelligence 1. Everyone has to choose between the two options they're given. <sighs> but what did you pick? Obviously, I picked being pretty, duh. I think I'll go for this one. Ooh, sorry, I saw something shiny. Look what you made me do! Oh, it was just a bug. Oh my god, I don't want to be really smart. I want to look like Bella Hadid. Hey, Bailey, can you please help me with something? Whoa, you look so different. Yeah, anyway, my car said change oil and I put vegetable oil in and now it won't start. You poured what into your car? Vegetable oil, like the one you put in pans when you cook. I can't help you. Did you guys know that a lighter lights things on fire? Is she for real? Did everyone pick being pretty except me? I think so. I picked that too. I love being pretty. That's not good. Kiss, Mary kill. Seriously, we're not in the fourth grade. It might be stupid, but you have to play. Why? Everyone has to play three randomized rounds. Okay, well, I guess it doesn't mean anything. Daniel's kind of cute, but he smells, and I do not want to sleep next to that forever. Hey, Bailey. Daniel, where did you come from? Um, I don't know, but do you want to make out? Eh, why not? That was so weird. I swear he just appeared. Sis, I just made out with Josh, and it was so good. We used tongue and everything. Okay, TMI. Michelle, she's my best friend. Of course I'm going to marry her. Hey, wifey. Where do you guys keep coming from? Um, what are you talking about? Never mind. Wait, does everything I pick in this game come true? Yeah, duh. Didn't you get it? That's the whole point of this. Doesn't that mean that... Cut my hair or slap my mom? Did you finally get your would you rather questions? You have to play. I don't want to do either of those things. Well, you have to pick one of them. Everyone must go through ten rounds of the game. Or what? If you don't play, you die. Got it? Okay, I'll play. I'm definitely not slapping my mom. My ends were dead anyway. What? Why does this game want me to hurt my mom? I'm not doing that. Guess I don't need to say anything today. Yes, they believe me. This girl really thinks that I'm her mom. I'm gonna do it tonight while she's asleep. I understand the mission. She won't be here much longer, okay? Honey, I thought you were in your room playing the game. Have so much fun. I need to get to work. I'll see you tonight. Come on, please give me blue. Mom will disown me if I get red. Pink? What the hell is pink? Why are you wearing that shirt? Oh, because that's the color I was assigned. You need to go take it off right now. What? Why? You cannot be walking around wearing pink. Go put on blue instead. Okay, jeez. Is this better? Yeah, nobody will be able to tell now. Okay, good. Oh, Bailey, you got blue too? Um, yeah, I did. Why did you say it like that? You seem nervous. Like what? I'm not nervous. I heard that Martha got the color purple. Like what? <laughs> purple? That's crazy. What does that mean? I don't know, but they said they're going to kill anyone with a different color. They're going to what? Um, yeah, you didn't know that? Are you okay? No, I'm fine. I just hope that nobody got pink. That's the worst color of all. What did you say? What? Why is pink the worst color? Because I heard it means that you're so evil they have to get rid of you. <gasps> you good? It's not like you're pink. Yes! <clears throat> I just choked. I need to go to the bathroom right now. Bye! Okay, it's fine. Nobody's gonna find out. Who's gonna know? I know. Ah! Why are you in the girls' bathroom? It's so much cleaner in here, I like it more. Okay. If you're talking about having an odd color, you're gonna be fine. No, I don't know what you're talking about. Don't listen to what they told you about it. It's not true. I'm so confused. I know that you're pink, and it's not anything bad. They just told me that it was. That's what they want everyone to believe, but it's not the truth. Do not tell anyone about your real color. I wasn't planning on it. The system doesn't like people like us. Well, what's your color? I was assigned the color black. 
What does that mean? You're emo? No, it gives me the ability to read minds. Hey guys, um, I wanted to come on here and show you my new gummies because I'm very excited to see if they work and see my results and show it with you guys. So, so these two cute little bottles are from Veravana and basically this brand works to increase your breast and your booty size. Both of these are completely vegan, cruelty free. They have all natural ingredients like flaxseed and fennel seed. They taste so good. Basically, you just take two a day. And after a couple months or whatever kind of trial you get, you start to notice results. On their website, there are so many clear results, and I am so excited to start trying them. I'm also so glad that they're completely vegan, because let me tell you, I'm completely vegan, and it is so hard to find supplements that don't have gelatin in them. Like, I can't even get melatonin gummies, because all of them have gelatin in them, so props. They also taste really good. I just ate two of these and two of these, so I am so excited. I recommend you go get them. Oh, you're frozen. You wouldn't mind if I took $20 from your wallet then, right? Thanks. Do you have a pencil I can borrow? Uh, yeah, I think so. Also, do you know why, like, everyone's frozen today? No, oh, I guess I haven't really noticed. So many teachers are frozen. I heard them talking about just canceling huh. school. I'm sure they'll be unfrozen eventually. Hello, Mia. She's frozen too. Who am I going to sit with at lunch? Mr. Michaels got stuck while using the toilet, so we have no class today. Hmm. Most of this classroom is frozen. Only me and you aren't... Okay, now just me. I need to find somebody else who can move. Hello? Hello? Am I the only one who's not frozen? Come, right down this way, gentlemen. Shit, I need to hide. As you can see, my plan worked. Everyone in this school is frozen. Now all we have to do is brainwash. Are you sure you don't have a crush on me? Yes, I'm sure. We're just friends. Why? No, just making sure. No. What the f- Tracy, can I try something on you? Sure, I guess. Great, thanks. What are you doing with those ugly glasses? You've been sleeping with my brother? What? He told you? I told you not to talk to him. But how did you know that? My glasses told me. So, are you messing with me? No, I'm not kidding. And we're not friends anymore. Good morning, class. Please put away your phones. Let's see what you're hiding. Bailey, your phone's still on your desk. <gasps> Are you okay? Could I go to the nurse? Go ahead. Okay. Hey, um, are you doing okay? No, I'm on my way to the nurse. Why? What's wrong? I think that there's some things, like, wrong with me. If you're talking about the glasses, nothing's wrong with you. I have them, too. Hey guys, and welcome back to Bailey's Tips to Being the Baddest Bitch You Can Be, part whatever. Today, we're going to be talking about my morning skincare routine and how I get my skin to be so dewy and glowing in the morning. So I'm starting by putting my hair up. I hate putting my hair in a little ponytail. It makes me look like an egg. She's obviously mad. An egg, a literal egg. Sorry. I'm going to start out by cleansing my face with the oat milk cleanser from Coco Kind. This is so gentle. I love it. I just take a dollop of it and rub it all over my face to get off all the dirt in the morning because, ew. Scrub, scrub, scrub. Next, I'm going in with the Coco Kind Rose Water Toner. This is so calming in the morning, and I literally adore it. This product is incredible. This is the Texture Smoothing Cream, also from Coco Kind. It has celery super seed, and I use it every single day. It makes my skin so clear. And lastly, the Revitalizing Eye Cream from Coco Kind. This also makes such a big difference on my eyes in the morning, so I look like I actually slept when I did. Hope you enjoy. Why is Amy's mark purple? It means she's your royal assistant. But she hates me. She's going to have to learn to like you. Bailey, can I talk to you? What's up, Lucas? I need to tell you something. Okay. We need to get out of here. Now. What? But we're royals. They're going to try to control us in everything we do. Are you serious? Unfortunately, yes. You have to believe me. No, I do believe you. I just don't want to leave my friends. We don't have to leave them. We just have to leave the system. They can all come with us. They can come with? Of course. Then yeah, let's do it. Oh, and one more thing. What's the catch? We have to get married. Married? Married? How would we even get married? We're 18. We can't... Do you want to make this right or not? Well, I do, but... Then we have to get married. Okay. 
So what do we do? We have to find a pass. What are you guys doing? Nothing. No, we're just hanging out. Hmm. You guys also have the power to change anyone's mark. We're in charge of everyone else's marks? Correct. Can I change my royal assistant then? No, that one's permanent. Great. I want gold. I want gold. No, me. I'm not doing it. Can we have a chat? What, Amy? I don't care what my mark says. I'm not coming with you. But you're my royal assistant. You can't not come with us. I don't care. I don't like you and I don't forgive you. Look, I'm sorry, but... It doesn't matter. I'm not going. I don't get why you have to get married. Because we have to be a queen and a king. Duh. You stole Lucas from me. No, it's just the... Um, guys. What? Look. What? She has a blue mark, too. No. Wait, I think I know what the mark means. Uh, what do you mean? We must be soulmates. Don't tell him. Tell me what? That you're right. We are soulmates. Yep, that's what the mark means. Wow, I didn't think I would ever find my soulmate. Yeah, really exciting. But that's not what... Okay. Bailey, could I talk to you for a second? I'll be right back. What are you doing? What? You said not to tell him. Yeah, but now he thinks you're his soulmate. There's no problem with that, as long as he doesn't know what it actually means. He's going to find out eventually. What happens when he accidentally does something? Then we just won't let him find out. Hey, we're back. Oh, good. Look what I did. What happened to her mark? Isn't that cool? I changed the color of her mark. <laughs> yeah, super cool. How, uh, how did you change her mark color to gold? I just said it was gold and there it was. Did you know that was possible? No, I definitely didn't know you could do that. Don't do it again. Why? Um, just no reason. Is something wrong? You seem nervous. Why would you say that? You're acting weird. I am not acting weird. I'm just weird in general. I mean, if you say so. What if I could change your mark? Um, uh, no, don't do that. Why not? I like my watermelon marks. Don't change them. But wouldn't it be cool to be famous? No. No, it, it wouldn't. You're sure you don't want me to change it? I'm positive. I don't want to be famous. I'm fine being perfectly normal. Okay. You're 100% sure. I definitely do not want you to change my mark. I think you do. Bailey's mark is gold. No! Are you ready to see your mark? Yes, I want to see it. Okay, three, two, one. The fuck? Nothing's there. Why don't I have one? Don't worry about it, sis. You'll get one. Ugh. Oh, thank God. You guys don't have marks either. No, I do. Mine's just on my forearm. On your arm? I thought they were supposed to be on your face. No, they can be anywhere. Oh. There's nothing on either of my arms, or my legs, or anywhere else. You probably just don't have one yet. Guess so. Rose has a red mark. Lucky her. I don't even have one. Yeah, she's so... L um, Bailey? What? T turn your head again. Why? There's no way. What is it? You do have a mark. What color is it? It's purple. Purple? Purple's not even an option. Guys, purple means all-powerful. What? Are you ready to see your mark? Yes, yes. Okay, three, two, one. Um, Blue? What is blue? I don't know what that means, but you should probably cover it. Cover it? Just do it, don't ask. Okay. Okay, jeez. Well, how does it look? It looks perfect. No one's gonna know. Okay, good. Hey, guys. Oh, you don't have your mark either? Oh, yeah, no mark yet. Me either. I'm hoping for the best. I hope I get gold, too. Mariella got gold. Are you serious? Yeah. That's awesome. I heard people have been getting random colors. Other colors. <laughs> Yeah, like purple and blue. Yeah, weird. Yeah, honestly, I just hope I get it. Oh my god, he has a blue mark. Blue? <laughs> That's weird. Um, blue means royalty. What?
Please be a main character. What? I didn't even know that villain was an option. Hey, honey, what'd you get? Side character. Oh, I'm so sorry. No, I'm perfectly fine with that. It's totally okay. You're being weird. No, I'm not. Just have a good day at school, okay? I will. <laughs> Bailey, you're not gonna believe this. What? <laughs> What'd you get? I'm a main character. Really? Isn't that so cool? It's me. Yeah, that's crazy. Are you a main character too? <laughs> Just a side character. Maybe you're my sidekick. Yeah. Why is Justin always texting you? Oh, it's probably something stupid. He's just my neighbor. I know, but he's my boyfriend. Trust me, I would not do that to you. You're coming to the party tonight, right? Yeah, I'll see you there. Great, I can't wait. And I'll write your name. Bailey, I'm so glad you could make it. Yeah, me too. If you need anything, I'll be upstairs. Cool, I'll let you know. She did not. Yo, Bailey, can I talk to you? Yeah, what's up? No, like, upstairs? Oh, you want to go somewhere? Um, okay. So? I have something to say, but don't freak out. Just spit it out already. I have feelings for you. What? No, no, you're dating my best friend. You like her, not me. That's the problem. I like you. We could be together. Don't you like me? No, no, I don't. Why don't you like me? Because I have morals. Come on, baby. No, don't touch me. Just, dude, literally stop. I just want to hold you. Bailey, what are you doing? It's not what it looks like. I knew you were lying to me. Here you are in a bed with him. No, that's not what was happening. Yes, it was. <sighs> what is that? Oh, sorry, hon. I forgot to tell you. We all get our timers today. Timers for what? We don't really know what they're for. They're just always there every year. You don't know what the timer means? It doesn't matter because the time is always so far away. What if yours isn't really far away? Then it runs out. We don't know what happens after that. Hey, are you okay? You're chewing your thumb off. No. Okay, well then what's wrong with you? My timer runs out in two hours. Oh my god, I am so sorry. I'm gonna miss you. Why are you saying I'm so sorry? When the timer runs out, you die. You didn't know that? What? Or at least that's what I think. Nobody's has ever run out before it refreshes. How much longer until it runs out now? One hour. I'm really gonna miss you. You're my best friend. It's about to run out. Goodbye. Can I take all your clothes? I'm alive. I don't care if everyone picks maximum years. I don't want to be here anymore. That should do it. <gasps> Bailey, what have you done? What do you mean? You set your timer so it would run out? Yeah, I want to know what happens. But you can't do that. You're going to die. I don't really have a problem with that. What about your family? We're all going to miss you. I'm sure it'll be fine. You guys are so dramatic. Your timer says 10 minutes. I know. Are you crazy? It's a death timer. You don't know that I'm going to die. Okay, but if you do die, can I have your sweater? No, you can't. Since you're not going to be here anymore, I just want to say I've always liked you. Mm, I don't like you back. What? But you always flirt with me. Oh, no, I was kidding. So you've just been messing with me? <laughs> yeah. You only have two minutes left on your timer. Guess we're going to see what happens then. I'm going to miss you. Why did you make your score private if it was so high? Because I didn't want anyone to know that I had a 10. But why not? I don't get it. I don't know. My mom told me not to. So you just listened to her? Yeah, pretty much. Oh, you're a mommy's girl then. Ew. Never say that again. <laughs> My bad. Okay, but how about that date though? I already told you, not happening. And I'm not giving up. Ugh. Just think about it. Why do you want to go on a date all of a sudden? You hated me three minutes ago. Well, you weren't smart to me three minutes ago. Thanks. If you're so smart, then go out with me. Yeah, but I'm also smart enough to know not to go out with a guy like you. What is that supposed to mean? Whatever you want it to mean. I still can't believe you're a 10. You are so immature. I am not. Just go on the date with me. Fine. Whatever. Great, but you're paying. Oh, man. I mean, I did crash my car last week, but I want something better. 
I just got $10,000. Really? You pick something that fast? Yes, that is so much money and I need it. That's why I'm going to be rich and you're not. Whatever, you loser. You are just acting so greedy. I am not greedy. Sure, if that's what you need to tell yourself. Bye. A hundred thousand dollars? Mm, but what if it gives me more next time? Mm. Hey, Bailey, I'm having a party tonight at mine. Want to come? I thought your mom didn't let you have people over. She doesn't, but I live in my own mansion now because of the game. Huh? Cool, right? What did you pick? I haven't picked yet. Really? That's kind of greedy. Why does everyone keep telling me that? Um, because it's true. A mansion? This is a hard one. <laughs> How are you going to throw me under the bus like that? Guys, relax. It's just a noise complaint. Keep it down, okay? Oh, okay. Yeah, we can keep the noise down. Enjoy your prom night. No, you were supposed to shut it down. Of course you would be behind this. And why are you even still here? Oh, I was peeing in that bush outside. You're in second and I'm right behind you. Better watch your back. Mm, I'm not worried. Wow, you look... Don't? I was just trying to be nice. Are you positive that we're going to win? Oh, yeah, I'm positive about it. How do you know? Yeah, that's because I rigged all the ballots so we would win. What? You rigged it? Shh. It all worked out. You wanted to be more popular, and now you're second forever. What? I don't want to be second. Well, you'll never be better than me. Everyone, it's time to announce our prom king and queen. Your prom king for 2023 is Jack Daniels. Thank you, guys. I never would have seen this coming. And for prom queen? Oh, it looks like there's been a tie. A tie? No, there can't be a tie. You're not in the tie. You didn't even <clears throat> make it to the finals. The tie that you have is with Misty Daniels. Who's Misty? Uh, my sister. I didn't know you had a sister. Yeah, I try not to tell people. I don't see Misty anywhere. So, Bailey, do you want to come get your crown? Okay. Here you go. Would you like to say anything to the crowd? Yeah, I would. A week ago, I would have cried with this crown on my head. But now that I'm up here, all I can think is, why does it even matter? I think all of you are special and beautiful in your own way, so really this crown belongs to everyone. Bailey, what are you doing? I'm doing what's right. Everyone, Jack cheated the system so that we would win. No, <gasps> whoa, oh my gosh. gosh. I would rather have no friends than friends that don't care about me, so this rank means nothing to me at all. Looks like it doesn't matter anymore. The ranks are gone. It's gone. You were right. We don't need it. Bro, you didn't flush the toilet again. Shut up. I'm about to be sorted. You're gonna get nerd. You've never done anything wrong. I have to. Yeah, right. You're a goody two-shoes. Why are you making that face? You'll see. Whoa, you got sorted as rebel? Turns out I'm not as innocent as everybody thinks. There is no way that you're a rebel. Is that so hard to believe? Bailey, please take off the hat. They're not allowed. No, I'm going to keep it on. Ooh, someone's in trouble. That's it. You're going to the office. Nah, I'm good. Go or I'm going to give you a zero. This is so fun. What? Are you ready to be sorted today? No, I don't want to be separated from you. We could get the same district. Which one are you hoping for? I want to be a farmer. And then I can hang out with all the animals on the farm. Aw, you'd be perfect for that. Everyone, please take your seats. I'll talk to you after the test, okay? Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Bitch, watch where you're going. You may now begin the sorting test. Please stay seated and just wait for your results to come out. You please tell me I'm going to be on a farm. There must be some kind of mistake. Bailey, I'm an outcast. What? What does that mean for you? I don't have a purpose. We don't do anything. Hey, outcast, come with us. What are you doing over here? This is for fighters? Yeah, that's the district that I got. Wow, they're just taking anybody now, huh? Like you could beat me in a fight? What are you, 5'5"? Five, five? I am 5'7". Let's go, everyone. Wait, isn't the train to get out over there? Oh, we don't take the train. We're going to jump on the rooftops. A couple of you guys noticed I have many, many hand tattoos. They're just not visible in my video, so let's do an updated tattoo tour. Just on this one hand, I actually have five. Ignore my tan, but we have angel wings and then a safety pin with a heart, four for four. She is art and then a rose because my middle name is Rose. I love this hand so much. We have a snake, but it needs to be fixed again. I have two butterflies, some sparkles, two, 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 and then a knife with two hearts. Silly me, I'm actually getting this one removed, so we're gonna skip it. This one's my favorite, this is Todd. And then this says size. I have two on my forearm, the flowers, and then crybaby. I don't know how to show this, but it's a lighter. This is my pig, Patricia. And then below it, we have a more. 
Over here, I have a cherub and then a cross, which I absolutely love. Surprise, I have one right here that says live your dream. And then we have a snake. This one says happiness. And then I have a single smiley face on my knee. Oh, yeah, I have a lot of tattoos. Life is fucking short. Do what you want. Dude, my dare is so easy. <laughs> really? What did you get? I just have to kiss my stepbrother. Ew, that's weird. Well, at least it's not anything dangerous. It could be worse. Yeah, I don't know if I would prefer that, though. I'll be totally fine to graduate as long as I don't get anything like that. You better hope that you get an easy dare, too. It'll be fine. I have to cover myself in peanut butter. What's your dare? Mine hasn't loaded yet. Everyone's supposed to have theirs already. Well, then why don't I have mine? You should go to the office. It might be broken. <sighs> of course it is. Excuse me, I haven't gotten my dare yet, and I'm really trying to graduate this year. Oh, let me look at the system. It probably glitched. I see the problem. It should be showing up right now. Oh, what the fuck? That can't be right. I thought all the dares were supposed to be easy and harmless. Sorry, I'm not in charge of the dares. That's what you got, and you have to do it. <sighs> Oh, good morning. Dude, what's up with your hair? My hair? Look at your hair, it's blue. Your hair is pink. What? Look. <gasps> yeah, so why do we look like this? I don't know. Should we ask mom? Mom, are you two freaking out about your hair up here? Yes, why is it like this? The color is how you're going to be sorted. I forgot to tell you guys. Sorted into what? Sorted into professions, but I don't know what pink means. Wait, is one side of your hair darker? No, it's just pink. The right side is red. We need to go right now. Get all your stuff and get into the car. Why? So who was going to tell me that my curtain bangs would look like this? I'm literally this leaf emoji. A truffle tree. Kidding, but apparently a lot of you cut bangs because of me. So this is how I style my wispy and curtain bangs. Most crucial and first part is dry shampoo. Bitches come go back. Spray liberally. Then I just kind of go like this. Go as crazy as your heart desires. This side too, because this one's worse. More scrubbing. Hello? Now that I look crazy, I'm going to use a dry volume spray. So now I'm just going to brush the bangs down. They really like the right side, which is annoying. A little fixing. I don't even know if that was helpful, but at least my bangs don't look wild now. Slay. My soulmate is only one mile away. I need to shave my legs. Great, now I have no hair but a bunch of razor bumps instead. <sighs> My soulmate is close again. Quick, you need to go and shave your legs then. I can't. I'm still recovering from the razor bumps from last time. I can't keep watching you suffer. You need to try you like. What's that? Put on the sunglasses and trust me. Okay. This doesn't hurt at all. And now you'll be completely hair free in just four weeks. No way. So with this, I could meet my soulmate at any time. I think I'm finally ready to meet them since now I have no hair forever. Hey, I think you're my soulmate. Why do you look like Bigfoot? Hey, um, isn't that guy over there your ex-boyfriend? Yes. Why is he at our school? He doesn't even go here. Maybe he's just dropping someone off. Everyone, please welcome our new student, Ryan. No. Is it a bad thing? You still talk to your exes. That's the problem. He's my only ex that I don't still talk to. Oh, what happened between you guys then? I don't want to bring it up. Oh, Bailey. It's uh funny to see you here, huh? You know that I go here. Why are you at our school? I had to transfer schools because of my parents' divorce. Whatever. Just don't bother me. Wait, I just wanted a second chance with you. You broke my heart. I finally got my zodiac sign. Really? What'd you get? It says Gemini. I'm so excited. Oh, you're a Gemini? Ooh. What's wrong with being a Gemini? Nothing, nothing. Fine, well then, what are you? I haven't gotten mine yet. As long as you're not a fire sign, I don't care. Okay, whatever. Bailey, we all got water signs. That's great. Don't you agree that water signs are the best? I don't know. What do you mean? What's your sign? Uh, Pisces. Then you should agree. Yeah. I can't wait to be put with all the other water signs. What? They're going to check our signs. Are you okay? No, I'm fine. Psst. Hey. Psst. Me? Yes, I need to talk to you. What? You weren't given a zodiac sign either, were you? Uh, how did you know that? 
It doesn't matter, but you need to come with me right now. Okay, fine. Where are we going? Somewhere that's quieter, so I can talk to you. Are you going to kidnap me because I'm an easy target? What? No, I just have to tell you this. Okay, well then spit it out. They're trying to eliminate all the fire signs. Why would they do that? They think they're too loud and dangerous. Well, what does it have to do with me? The reason that you and me didn't get a sign is because we're both fire. How do I know that you're telling the truth? I promise you, just trust me on this one. Okay. I need you to go tell your friends that you're a Leo. A Leo, but... Don't worry, it'll all work out. Guys, I have something to tell you. Um, okay, what's up? I'm not actually a Pisces. I'm a Leo. What? You need to get away from us. What? We cannot talk to a fire sign. Maybe if you were Earth, but you need to leave. Just go. There she is with the purple hair. She's the fire sign. Uh-oh. Morning. Your balance is so low. Can you even buy words? Did my paycheck not come in the mail yesterday? Uh, no. Nothing with your name on it came. I need to call them. I'm not going to be able to speak. Do it now before you run out. Hello? Why haven't you guys sent me my paycheck yet? I worked 20 hours. Hey, so we actually got busted for fraud and our company's going bankrupt. Fraud? But what about my money and my hours? Yeah, we can't pay you for any of it. I'm so sorry. Oh, shit. Dude, did you just waste your last two words saying, oh, shit? Really? We need to find a different way that you can make money so you can actually speak again. Before you ask, no, I cannot give you any money. I barely have any myself. Hey, so the neighbor put up this flyer. She's looking for a dog sitter tonight. Do you want to do it? Perfect. Hey, love, this is my dog, Marshmallow. <laughs> Sorry, she's a little feisty one. Honey, why do you look like a chipmunk? You can breathe, you know. Why are you doing that? <sighs> I was trying to hold my oxygen in. For what reason? You know our family has infinite oxygen cans. Well, about that. I kind of lost my special canister. You did what? I'm sorry. How many sips do you have? Twelve. You better hope that you get that can back. Uh. Bailey, can you please give me a sip of oxygen? I'm sorry, Amanda. I can't today. What? But you always do. Don't be greedy. I know you have infinite. I lost my can and now I have a regular one, so I can't. I'm sorry. Uh-oh. How the hell did you lose your special can? I don't know. I put it down on my desk, and when I turned around, it was gone. Do you think that somebody would have stolen it from you? You think somebody would have the balls to steal my oxygen can? Oh, do you mean this oxygen can? Zach. <laughs> hey, do you want a piece of gum? Oh, sure. Thanks. Hey, would you want to go on a date with me tonight? What? I just think you're beautiful. You literally hate me. What? No, definitely not. Why are you sitting there? What do you mean? Get up and go somewhere else. I always sit here. We're best friends. Yeah, definitely not anymore. You're delusional. What the fuck is going on? On behalf of the entire football team, we would like to perform a song for Bailey. Uh, why did the entire football team just serenade you? You know, I really wish I could answer that, but I'm not sure myself. How's that gum tasting? Um, it just tastes like gum. Why? I was just checking to see if you felt different. What? Uh, nothing. Never mind. What? Bye! <laughs> Girl, you better spit out that gum. It makes everyone who hates you love you, and everyone who loves you hate you. Huh? <sighs> oh, you gotta be kidding me. I literally look like I got hit by a car. Girl, what the hell is going on with your hair? Please, don't mention it. Mm -hmm. You need to stop spending all your diamonds. Okay, but look what I spent it on. Worth it. Oh, come on. How is that even fair? Bailey, you got a 2% on the math final. What? I'm really bad at math. Hey, beautiful. You want to go on a date with me? You're asking me on a date when I look like this? Yeah, I think it's a vibe. I mean, you must be really desperate. So, sure, I guess. I'll pick you up at 7, sweet cheeks. <laughs> I know you guys don't care when I do anything but POVs, but let's put on an outfit together for the music show I'm going to! I'm thinking this dress from AFRM. It's super fun and it has sleeves. I'm just hoping that I won't be insecure in it. I actually really like this. I think it's very flattering. I also figured out that the gloves have fingers, so we'll see how that goes. 
I added this little white headband, but I definitely need to fix my bangs because what? Okay, I put on this cross chain belt too. I know you guys are gonna ask where it's from. I'm so sorry. It was one of a kind from the Melrose Trading Post. I just added more chains. Um, I feel like the headband's not gonna go because my shoes are black. These are the boots, they're from Steve Madden, and they're glorious. This is where we're at, but I feel like it needs more. Is less more, or is more more? This is what I have decided to go with, plus that bag I was just holding. I think the tights made it a little bit better. I don't know how I'm gonna do anything with these gloves on, but I love it. Slay. I can take your order when you're ready. Can I just get a number six? Of course. Is that all? Yeah. Uh, we give out a free dum-dum with each order. Thanks. Hey, what can I- wait, weren't you here yesterday too? You remember me? I don't think I could forget. Let me guess, you want to get a number six. How did you know? I have no idea. It must have been <laughs> luck. And here's your dum-dum. Have a good day. Thank you. Oh, look, it's my favorite customer. Stop, you're making me blush. So, what's your name, if you don't mind that I'm asking? It's Bailey. I don't mind. My name's Lucas. You should try the number one instead. It's my favorite. You know what? Sure. Enjoy the dum-dum and have a good day. You too. I can help who's next. Oh, hi, where's Lucas? He moved to a different location. He doesn't work here anymore. Wait, but you told me you had no idea who he was. I just didn't want to remember him. So you're just going to lie to me about it then, huh? You abandoned me. That is not the same thing. Yes, it is. And honestly, I think this date is over too. Wait, but I thought that... Don't. Work is gonna suck today. Oh, uh, hey, good morning, Bailey. Hey, Tate. Where did this dum-dum come from? I'm not sure. It was just on your desk when I got here. Are you okay? You look a little stunned. No, I'm good. Looks like he didn't even bother showing up to work today. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, good morning, Bailey. Good morning, Tate. How are you doing? Why do lollipops keep appearing on your desk every day? Yeah, uh, I don't know. Orange is the worst flavor. At least leave a good one. Enough. It probably was just an accident. Looks like your man didn't show up today, either. He's just a coward. Another one? Give me that. No. Why not? Why are you being protective? No reason. I just really like them. I wanted to ask if you would go on a date with me. A date? Yeah, like dinner or something. Why wouldn't you? You literally ruined my last date. Uh, that's not true. <laughs> I just... Can I have everyone's attention? Okay, are you ready to see what color you got? Yes, I hope I'm just a civilian. There is no way you'll be a criminal. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Big reveal. Three, two, one. Oh shit, that's not good. What? Uh, <laughs> here's a mirror. <gasps> You better go put on the most high-coverage concealer you have. Okay, I will. Whatever you do, don't tell anyone that you have a red mark. I got it. Ah, oh, finally you're here. Oh, hey. I don't have my mark yet. Did anything come for you? No, nothing showed up. Imagine if one of us actually had a red mark. That would be <laughs> so bad. You're so funny. Amber got caught putting a red mark on her face this morning. That's weird. Why would you want to be a criminal? I don't know, but they're going to find her out during the mark check. During the whom and a Well, they have to check everyone's mark to make sure. Are you hiding something? Nope. Can't wait to find out who's lying during the mark check. Why do you look like that? What? Are you good? You're acting so weird. No, I told you. I'm fine. Oh, looks like I'm up next for the mark check. Have fun. Excuse you. Oh, I am so sorry. Your mark is red. I know, but I'm not dangerous. No one believes me. Do you? No, I believe you. My name's Casey. Nice to meet you. Bailey. Up next is Bailey. I gotta go. We will be checking both sides of your face for a mark. Is that okay? <laughs> yep, that's fine with me. Okay, left and right. Um, not that fast. Go a little slower. Okay, you're good. Okay, great, bye. Wait, we need you to take off the makeup. What? Why? We just have to make sure you don't have a mark. I can't. I'm insecure. Take the makeup off or we'll take it off for you. Okay. Like, guess the lyric for five million dollars? Obviously, yes. 
Karma takes all my friends to the summit. This could be the original or the remix. Facts. Yes, I got it right. I already got eliminated because I sang the regular version of oh. Karma. You should have picked the remix. If you give me some of the money, I'll help you win. No way. Just think about it. We'll have better odds if there's two of us. Fine, I guess you're right. I'll take 20%. Shh, wait, the next one. A hopeless romantic all my life. I don't know it. Oh my gosh, I do. It was all over TikTok. It's surrounded by couples all the time. Surrounded by couples all the time? Yes, I'm going to buy a yacht with the money. You would have lost if it wasn't for me helping you. Shawty had them apple bottom jeans, boots with the fur, with the fur. Why do you know that song? You don't. How far up am I on the rankings? All it says is that you're within the top 500. Continue to the next level. You have to do it. We have a chance at winning this. Bitch, you will not believe what just happened to me. What happened? Tell me. I have a date to the prom. What? Who is it? Charlie. Charlie. Like the quarterback, Charlie. Yeah, that one. You need to tell me how you got him, girl. Uh, it's a long story. Hang on, he's calling. Hey. Hey, what are you doing right now? Uh, nothing. Why? Come over to my place. I have something to tell you. I just sent the address in the chat. Okay. Be there soon. Hey, what's up? There's been a small change in our plans. What kind of change? You need to run for prom queen. You want me to be prom queen? Yes, it'll work, trust. That's never gonna happen. It will if you're seen with me. I can't be prom queen, I mean... You can. Meet my sister Alexa, she's gonna help you. We're gonna give you a makeover. A makeover? You can trust her, she's good. Okay. I got invited to my first TikTok event ever after being a creator for literally two years. We're gonna put on the fit together because you guys are genuinely not ready. I have managed to get this top onto my body, but it was not without a lot of struggle, but it's very cute. This is the skirt that is going with it. Ah! I'm so excited. Okay, over top of the skirt, we're gonna put this belt. <laughs> I think I did it upside down. I'm unsure if I did this correctly, but this is what we're gonna go with because I am running out of time. She gave me these beautiful bows for earrings. Why is this so struggle? Next up. Cross necklace. I have found two socks and they do not match. At least they're both striped. I feel like that's okay. Maybe. For shoes, we have the iconic naked wolves. Whoa, I'm so much taller. We're doing some fishnet gloves. We're looking slick. Bye. Last, but certainly not least, is this jacket from Alabama Blonde. This is our final outfit. This is definitely one of the coolest things I've ever worn. Mm -hmm. Just a freak, yeah. Okay, bye. Excuse me, you dropped this. Oh, thank you. Wait, this isn't my hat. Uh, just keep it. I think it'll look great on you. Whoa, caught me off guard there. I've never seen you in a hat. It's not mine. Some random old lady gave it to me. It kind of looks cute on you. You're pregnant? No, I, uh, how did you know? I didn't tell anyone. Um, I don't know. I just kind of knew. Please don't tell mom and dad. I haven't said anything. I won't. What are you doing right now? Uh, not much, really. Why? Come over. Okay, I'll be there in a few. Hey, great. Hey, what's going on? This little old lady gave me this hat and I think it tells me everyone's biggest secret. Whoa, slow down. What are you talking about? Test it on me so you know if it really works. Okay. I don't even know what my secret would be. Get out. What? Get the fuck out of my house. Cupcake. I don't want a cupcake. <sighs> Dude, what is that noise? I have no idea. May I have your attention, everyone? The annual purge is beginning now. All crime will be legal for 24 hours continuously. All medical and police services will be unavailable. I wish you all good luck and have a great time during the annual purge. This is just a big joke, right? I mean, it's the plot of that movie. It must be. Halloween's coming up super soon. This message was provided by your government. I don't think it's a joke. Shut all the windows and lock all doors. This cannot be happening. It's real. What are we supposed to do? I don't know. Oh, Bailey, won't you come downstairs for us? I don't believe you. I need proof. Fine. Show her my DNA test. 
But this test says that there's two from the royal bloodline. Two? What do you mean, two? Do you have any siblings? Not half ones. Yeah, I have a full sister. There's no way. You both are royalty. What? How is it possible that both of you ended up together? I don't know. We were left on a doorstep. Your sister must agree to rule with you. Mm, there is no way my sister is going to do that. Well, who wouldn't want to be royalty? Her? Yeah, she's kind of a bitch. You must at least try. Okay, but I'm warning you, it's not going to work. I'll be back in with my sister to overrule you. Whatever, get her out of my sight. Mm -hmm. Sis, I have something to tell you. Okay, that didn't sound good. You know how we were adopted? Yeah, of course. Yeah, so we're actually part of the lost royal family. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I already knew that. Today I'm going to be giving myself eyelash extensions. Not really, but this Tarte mascara is supposed to make it look like you have lash extensions. This is their new tubing mascara, and I've been seeing it everywhere, so I just need to put it to the test because I've been looking for a good mascara. I have long lashes naturally, but they just won't stay up. Ow. <laughs> First, we're gonna curl. Oh, that looks so terrifying. This is what the wand looks like. I personally love the small bristles, so if you do too, this is good for you. Okay, this is my first time using it, no joke. Hello? I'm in shock. This is one coat. Okay, coat number two. Do I even need to say anything? I mean, look at this eye. My natural lashes are a little bit wonky, but nonetheless, they have never been this long. I recommend trying this if it doesn't sell out. Also, this is not sponsored. I just love Tarte. She's a woman. There's no way she could stab three grown men. That's a bit sexist. A woman could easily kill a man with the right motivation. Hey, Susie, love that necklace of yours. Oh, thank you. My mom made it for me. Yeah, I can tell. <laughs> Hey, actually, you should come to my party later tonight. Louie, I've never been to a party. Here's the address. Be there at midnight, okay? Thanks, I'll be there. This is where I'm supposed to be, but I don't see anybody here. Maybe I should just call her. The number you have reached is no longer in service. Please... She blocked me? I think I've been played. Hey, a penny. At least I got something out of this. It's pretty shiny. Maybe it's a lucky penny. I wish that I was hot. I don't think it worked. Oh, good morning, honey. Finally, you've woken up. Good morning, but I was just... You need to leave. The keys are in front of you. I drive a Mercedes. I know it's not a G-Wagon, but it'll do until later, right? Okay, sick. See you later. Hey, girl, are you new here? I've never seen you before. Um, yeah, I am new. Has anyone ever told you you're, like, really pretty? Thanks. You should totally be friends with us. Of course I'll be your friend. Payback's a bitch. Three, Three, two, two one. one! Happy birthday! Thanks, Mom! I got you this special necklace. It's beautiful. I love it. No matter what happens, never take it off. Never? Don't ask questions, okay? Okay, I won't. Happy 18th, Bailey! Thanks, guys. I love that necklace. Oh, thanks. My mom gave it to me. So, could I try it on? Uh, no, sorry. What? Why not? I can't. She told me not to take it off. Oh, okay. Want to come to mine after school? Yeah, sure. Cool. Meet me here at four. Okay. Wow, uh, your house is really dark. Oh, yeah, Um, our power went out. Oh, okay. I brought you some water. Thanks. <laughs> what happened? Good morning. Where's my necklace? Your necklace is mine now. I'm royalty, not you. What? Royalty? What are you on? That was a gift from my mom. Whoever wears that necklace will be the next one to rule. And I have it. Am I being cranked? No, but you might as well be because you're easy to trick. <laughs> Why are you laughing at me? Because you don't actually have my necklace. What? I'm literally holding it. You really think I didn't suspect you? No, I, I thought you were stupid. You asked to try it on four times. Of course I know what my own necklace means. Well, it doesn't matter, because I have it. Or do you? How did you give it? Uh-uh, not so fast. You have a decoy. Now, if you don't mind, I gotta get out of here. Hey, wait a minute. Who are you? I'm her stepbrother, Liam. Don't bother trying to stop me. I'm not gonna try to stop you. I just need your help. I don't even know you. I didn't want to start with this, but I'm a prince. You're a what? Please put me in the year close by. 2024? That's perfect. 
Bailey, I heard that Sarah was gonna come ask you out. Really? But she didn't like me last year. She does now, but your skin is so oily. Hey! You need to fix it. I'll just use my perfect diary powder. It's so blurring. Isn't putting more on top gonna mess up your makeup? No way. It's super lightweight and waterproof. Oh my gosh, I need to try that. See how smooth my skin looks? I feel refreshed. Give me that powder. I need that powder now. Give it to me. No way. I'm not going to give you my favorite powder. Oh, please. You know that's not true. Hey, you guys want to play Truth or Dare? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm down too. Okay, Cody. Truth or Dare? Uh, Dare. I dare you to kiss Lacey. Guys, what the fuck? No. Oh, come on. Have a little fun. You're not kissing him. He's my boyfriend. Yeah, you want to bet? See? No harm done. No, that's enough of this game for me. I'm leaving. Bailey, wait. What? Why are you being like this? Why would you do that? You knew it was going to make me mad. It's just a game. It doesn't mean anything. Whatever. Why won't this door open? Maggie, can you please unlock the door? What do you mean? The front door is not locked. Yes, it is. It won't open. What the fuck? None of the doors or windows will open. How would everything be locked? I didn't do it. Yo, what? It just, it won't open. That doesn't make any sense. Who wants to play a game? Happy 18th, honey. Thanks. Here you go. What's this? That's your heart. This is just a piece of paper. Yeah, but it represents your heart. Huh? Every time someone hurts you after a relationship, you lose a piece of the paper, which is your heart. What happens if I run out of paper? You can never fall in love again. <gasps> Be careful with it. I will, I promise. Lucas! Hey! I want to give you this. Your heart? But why? I've always had a crush on you. I'm sorry, I don't like you as more than a friend. Here's your paper. Sorry about the corner. Hey! What's up, babe? We should go our separate ways. What? I'm just not in love with you anymore. I'm sorry. No! Oh, I got it. Don't worry. You can't lose this. Thanks. Huh. If you're so famous, why do you want to talk to me? Fame doesn't matter. I just like genuine people. If only you could get a new piece of paper. I wish it was that easy. I'll never get my paper back. I think I know a way you can. How? The paper will come back when you fall in love with the right person. I don't think I can ever fall in love again. I know, but you deserve to be happy no matter what. Do you like rock music? Yeah, it's like my favorite. Come sit front row at my concert. Really? Yeah, I would love for you to watch. Sure. Make sure you don't lose that. I won't. Okay, good. Who are you? Oh, I was invited by the guitarist. The guitarist? My boyfriend? Your what? My boyfriend invited you? I don't know, he just told me to show up. Ah, uh, and you did? Yeah. You can't be blaming me. Yes, I can. Security, get her. Why would you kill him? I was just trying to save you from him. If the police weren't after me before, they sure as fuck are now. It's fine. Just calm down. No, I'm not going to calm down. Let's just go, okay? Get away from me. You're not going to stay? I was trying to help. No. I can protect you like I just did. You're insane. No, I'm not. Just listen to me. You can't leave me. I'm out of here. Hey, hon, how did your interview go? Did you get it? Uh, yeah, I did get the job. <laughs> oh, why are you being weird then? I'm not being weird. Well, I'm so proud of you. If you need anything, let me know. Thanks. I'll let you know. Ah! Oh, fuck. Surprise. Why the fuck are you at my window? Because you can't just leave me. I told you I'm not interested. I have something important to say. Fine, what? You can't tell anyone you have infinite years. You broke the system. I literally don't understand what you're talking. Are you new? <gasps> oh my god, hi! What's your name? I'm Bailey. So nice to meet you. You're really pretty. Has anyone ever told you that? <gasps> they should. Moer, you're literally beautiful. The eyes, the hair, the smile. Do you model? You really should. Anyway, do you have any friends here yet? <gasps> no? Oh my god, we can be friends. <gasps> yeah, seriously. Definitely. Okay, so I'll teach you what you need to know. Basically, over there we have Jack, Josh, Amber, and Marina. 
problem with that is that Jack is dating Maria, and Maria and Amber are best friends, except Jack and Maria have broken up, like, four times in the past, like, five months, which is ridiculous and so stupid. But anyway, Jack literally cheated. But anyway, over there we have the dealers. Like, I would stay away from them because one of them asked me to pay with, like, no cash. Like, if you want to, you know, it's like, no. But anyway, I'm having a party this weekend. Do you want to go? <gasps> really? Yay! Okay. Oh, I can finally guess letters. Well, go ahead then. Do it. Okay, um, Z. Aw. Girl, why would you pick Z? What do you mean? That's just such a bizarre first choice. That was a good guess. Try guessing a vowel or something. Okay, fine. A. Don't waste your guesses. C. Your name is pretty short. I'm sure he'll figure it out. Yeah, he'll probably get it quick. My soulmate already got three letters of my name. Really? On the first day? I know. What about you? Well, Mine hasn't gotten any. Really? Your name has so many vowels. I know. Is he really bad at guessing, or has he not guessed at all? Maybe he was just trying weird letters first. Soulmates are so stupid. I am not guessing her name. I don't care at all. I don't want her. No, it can't be. W. Oh. Macy, there's something I need to tell you. Uh, okay, what's it about? It's about- Hey guys, what's up? Hey Wyatt, what's up? Are you ready for a one year tomorrow? <laughs> yeah. Y'all make a great couple. Don't you get three more guesses today? Um, yeah, I do get more guesses. Okay, well then guess something. X. Girl, why the fuck would you pick X? Oh no, there's no X. <laughs> Soulmates aren't real. This is so dumb. Okay, we get it. You don't believe in love, you fucking weirdo. Damn, harsh. Sorry. Your hair is so ugly. You tell me that every day. Because every day, it's true. Okay, call me when you don't have a bowl cut. Stop messing around. Guess again. Q. You stress me out. What? Sorry. Maybe I should just guess one letter. No, don't guess. What? Why not? Uh, well, you just said you don't believe in soulmates, so... Hey, there was a letter from your soulmate in the mail. Hand it over! Make sure you tell us what it says. Are you guys messing with me? No? What do you mean? All it says is fuck off and it's not even on a real piece of paper. I didn't do that. Maybe it was the only piece of paper he had. Ugh. My soulmate says my eyes shine as bright as diamonds. That is so beautiful. Mm. I cannot wait until I can reply to him. When it's my turn, my soulmate is not getting that nice of a letter. Hey, Barney, my favorite. That is not my name. Oh, I know. I just don't care. You must have been so sad this morning when you didn't get a letter. Actually, I did get a letter from my soulmate. Really? And what did that letter say? That I'm beautiful and he can't wait to meet me. Attention students, there's an emergency assembly in the cafeteria. What kind of emergency could there be? I just heard that someone's been faking everyone's soulmate letters. You going to the football game tonight? Um, I don't think so. What? Why not? I don't have anyone to stand with. Girl, you can stand with me. Seriously, just come. It'll be fun. <laughs> Thank you. We have a note for Marissa here. You got a soulmate note? Oh, I guess so. You haven't? No, he hasn't sent anything yet. He said, I can't wait to see you, beautiful. That is so cute. I'm sure yours will say something soon. We have a soulmate note for Bailey. I got one? I told you. I have a girlfriend and you're probably ugly anyways. Does it really say that? Give it to me. Oh, wow. That's awful. Great. You have to write something back. Like what? Defend yourself, sis. What are you going to write? That should be good. And then I ended the note by calling her ugly. <laughs> Did you hear that too? Isn't that what your note said? Yeah. We share the same height, but I'm five foot three. Apparently me and my soulmate share the same toes. What does that even mean? Wow, and I thought mine was bad. I know. What's yours? They're my height. Well, that's not even that bad. Short people are so cute. It'll be easy to find them since I'm looking them right in the eyes. That's a good way to look at the bright side. You got any money for lunch, freak? Can you just put me down? Guys, stop. What are you doing? We're throwing them into a dumpster, <laughs> duh. This isn't a high school movie. That's so mean. 
Yeah, and what are you gonna do about it? Need I remind you that my dad is the principal? No, no you don't need to remind us. Have a good day. Okay, bye. I am so sorry about them. Are you okay? Yeah, uh, I'm okay now. Thank you. Oh, you're short? Yeah, I know. Everybody makes fun of me for it. Please have at least $7 so I can go get a venti pink drink. Ugh, $4.20? Hmm. So I'm gonna starve and I can't get Starbucks. My soulmate has three million dollars. Mine has 40 million. What about you, Bailey? Yeah, about the same. Does that mean you'll come shopping with us on Rodeo Drive later? Uh, I think I'm gonna save all of the money. Boo, you're no fun. You're gonna miss out. Oh, hey mom, what's up? I just transferred your allowance of $10,000 into the account. You have to take that money out right now. It's too late to take it out. It's already processing. Why? My soulmate's in charge of the bank account. Your soulmate can't spend $10,000 today. I really hope not. Whoa, Dylan, I love your fit today. Did you go shopping or something? Are you wearing a Louis Vuitton belt, necklace, and shoes? Yeah, my soulmate had a ton of money, so I went and spent, like, all of it.